where two security forces, Jawan and two terrorists were killed during a fierce encounter in Rewadi in Kulgam district. An encounter started with the army, police and CRPF launched an overnight operation following specific information about the presence of terrorists in residential houses. After five hour long encounter, two hold up uh, terrorists were killed. Nazir joining us on the phone line for the latest. Uh, Nazir, what more do we know? Well, uh, Sonal, this operation is still underway in Redwani and where the main gunfight seems to be over, where two militants have been killed. Both are locals, but our police forces are telling us. But one army soldier has lost his life in this encounter. There were earlier reports that some Jawan has been taken a captive, but no confirmation about that as yet. Uh, uh, but but this is one of the series of operations which have been launched in last one week. In, in one week, 19 militants have been killed so far. And this operation was you know, launched based on specific information. So it's now clear that the security force are getting now free information about presence of militants about frequently, and they are launching no more frequent operations against militants. Besides this encounter, there has been two other operations which have been uh, operations which have been launched in tall area of Pulwama district. In one uh, operation, one militant is believed to be trapped inside a residential house, and some are saying he may be from the ISJK. So then there's another operation where we don't know if any militant is trapped or not, but that search operation is underway. So, but in this uh, encounter, in Kulgam encounter, uh, this was a very, very tough operation for the security force. There has been large auto situation, stone pelting as well near the encounter side. That has been a challenge for the security forces. But I can tell you in last one week, 19 militants have been killed so far by the security force in, in various operations. All right, uh, Nazir uh, telling us there that there are 19 terrorists who have been killed in the past one week. Nazir, also there are panchayat elections underway in one of the phases. Has this had an impact at all on that? And, uh, well, uh, where we see the participation, the areas which participate in polls, it doesn't have any impact. Gun has lost that coercive power to, you know, change the mood of people. But there have been areas where there has been either total boycott or there has been you know people who don't uh, you know where no candidate actually is has is stands for this election so it's a mixed bag of things there are areas where we have we witnessed brisk polling in last three days the same would be today as well so it is different areas different stories it is a local election and depending on the candidates and the atmosphere in a particular area but because of these encounters there would not be any much impact on those polls